Now you can actually make designs with the correct text using only AI. Yes, using this new AI tool called Ideogram, you can finally make text designs. So first go to ideogram.ai and sign up easily with your Gmail account. It's now a free tool and we hope it stays free in the future. Anyway, once you sign up, you will start seeing what other people are creating. Like, check this out, Llama Retro Design. You can see the four variations that he generated, which are pretty cool for a t-shirt. Also, you can see the exact prompt that he used and if you want to use this image as a reference you can do that by clicking remix in the top and then you will see the prompt that you can edit like let's say i want a cat instead of llama for this design well i'm just gonna change the word llama with cat and click generate it takes about 20 seconds or 25 seconds for the images to be generated and as you can see now we got four variations i like the second design the most the graphic looks very good for a print on demand t-shirt even though the text is not 100 percent perfect when you write the prompt you got styles you can use for generating the images i see that poster and typography and illustration styles are great for t-shirt designs and also you can pick the aspect ratio that you want generally for print on demand it's 10 16 because the resolution that we use is 4500 by 5400 now let's say i want to put this in real action i found this niche spooky squad and i want to make a design for it i'm just gonna try to use a simple prompt let's say yeah ghost vector for a t-shirt design with text and the text is spooky squad for the styles i'll go with poster and typography then generate and take a look at this one the graphics are great the text is on point this will make a very good t-shirt design the other ones are decent though the only problem with this first one is the pumpkin graphics they are kinda weird and if for example there was a mistake in the text in this last image you can get four new variations that look very similar to this one just click remix in the top and let me add some other styles like illustration and anime as well then generate all right for new designs that are kind of the same so when you're generating and you like this specific image and it had a small problem maybe the text is not 100 percent correct or the graphic is not good make sure to use this remix option to get some better results now there is multiple designing ways i found interesting using this ai that will make your design stand out in the competition let's start with the text in shapes for example here i made this design be kind in a shape of heart and my prompt was pretty simple t-shirt design with text that says be kind in shape of a heart if i had to make this design manually it's gonna be hard and take a lot of time but i got it here in like couple seconds i mean if i want to use this design now i will just upscale it and vectorize it and it will show great on a t-shirt i'll show you later on in the video how to upscale and vectorize the images that you generate for free i also made this other one the name flexness is shaped like a dog what wait why did they choose dog I don't know anyway i got this results which are pretty cool the second and the third one are good this kind of shape style try to use it on short niches to get more perfect results next design style that you should abuse with this ai is the typography text designs this style is great when you find a niche selling only in text-based designs like let's suppose this is my niche that i want to work on that's a horrible idea what time and in the prompt i'll just say for example t-shirt text design with typography style with this text that's a horrible idea what time and for the styles typography of course vibrant and poster and that's not too bad from only one try this third image is good and the ai added the question mark without me asking for it in the prompt there is an r missing in horrible to fix that i can just click remix again to get four new variations and no, this design here could work. The next style I would also use with this AI is the retro vintage designs. Since I knew prints on demand, this style always sell very well in pretty much all the niches. I will take this niche for example, hoops, I did it again, which is a retro based design and my prompt was pretty simple as well. Vintage retro distressed Duncan man basketball silhouette design with the text hoops, I did it again. And I got this shirt design which is good, but the text is missing the word dead, the graphic in the other hand will work perfectly if you want also to use this style just swap out in the prompt Duncan man basketball with whatever niche you work with now to upscale an image i use this website i'll link it in the description let's take this design for example just download it by clicking this icon then drag that image here like this and scale it to around 8 and click submit and that's the result the quality look much better you can just remove the background now and the design will be ready but if you use illustrator and want to vectorize it go 
to this website also linked in the description just upload your upscaled image and wait a couple seconds and you see that the image now is vectorized anyway let's now talk about commercial usage the websites say that you can't use the generated images for commercial usage but let me ask you a question have you ever got an email asking you to give a license for a graphic you ever used i personally have thousands of designs on redbubble t public amazon merge etsy and i have never got an email asking me to provide a license of a graphic i used but it's your choice in my case i'm not gonna use the designs now i'll wait to see the future of this tool because they're not doing it for charity of course they will make paid plans eventually for commercial uses just like mid journey but i'll still use it to get inspired and let me know your opinion about this in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe see ya